Hey guys and welcome back to XCOM 2. We are in my base ship called the Avenger and we are waiting for like alien debris and stuff like that to be cleared. We have just failed miserably at saving our guys from uh, an advent strike. That's okay, we, we can deal with that. I think we're going to go and try and make contact with New Mexico. This, this seems like the thing that we need to be doing here. So we're going to fly on over. It takes a couple of hours. No real hardship. Again, it's gone from two to seven. Big jump there. I don't, I don't know why it did that. Uh, and what we're going to do... Oh, look. We're going to make our contact here. Uh, it's going to take five days, but we're going to go for it. Let's do it. Priority message coming through, Commander. Putting it on screen now. Okay. Let's accept that transmission. It's unfortunate, Commander, that your recent efforts have proven to be so mediocre. Oh, what? Mediocre? You call me me? I've failed one mission, man. One mission. Uh, new staff have turned up. We've got Sandra Hughes and Jay Walker, who we'll probably change the name of. Recruit new staff of Resistance HQ. Does that mean we need to go back to Resistance HQ to do that? So we have uh, failed a retaliation, and we've done all this like good stuff. So that's obviously mediocre, right? Commander, we have intel suggesting the aliens are working on developments that threaten our ability to stop the Avatar project. We can conduct guerrilla operations to disrupt one of these efforts, but we'll have to choose carefully. We don't have the resources to intercede everywhere. Oh, wow. This this is not good. Uh, what, well, what are these we're going to have to deal with at some point? Can we click on these? We cannot. In fact, there is nothing to do here apart from click the back button. Commander, the Resistance has a hidden cache of resources stashed outside of Advent's reach. But that means we'll have to fly over and scan the area if we want to recover this stuff for ourselves. But I'm making contact. Um, I'm going to ignore it for now. We can go. We can go and deal with that, right? We can go and deal with that. We're going to try and carry on making contact. Yeah, this, this is the the thing that I want to do. Uh, we've got a little while to part. Oh, God, I am sure keep getting interrupted. Results to be as intriguing as I do, Commander. I hope this is going to be as intriguing as you think it is as well. Uh, sectoid autopsy, blah de blah. We can make mind shields and psionics. The aliens' mastery of genetic engineering and their pursuit of advancement, regardless of the risks. Yeah, well, you know that's what they do. Uh, the mind shield is a powerful psionic artifact, rendering soldiers completely immune to any negative mental conditions, including panic, mind control, stuns, and disorientation. Which would be nice to like not have that panic. That's how we lost a, a, a guy. Flemmy decided that, you know, because he was panicked, he wanted to go and hide behind an exploding car. That wasn't very good, was it? Uh, resistance radio, magnetic weapons, advent trooper autopsy. Look, we could get that one done fairly quickly. The faceless autopsy could also be done fairly quickly. We could decrypt a data pad. No, that's not really what we're looking for. Oh, look, these things need these stuff. I think we're going to go for the advent trooper no, autopsy. My past surgical experience is limited. I am sure the crew appreciates that I hone my skills on fallen advent forces before triaging our own wounded. To the uninitiated, the common advent trooper is seemingly human. The aliens seemingly. have disguised this most glaring divergence from the human form with a carefully designed helmet. Well, yeah, you know, if you want them to blend in, you've got to stop them looking like aliens, right? You, you've got to make them look like people. Because, you know, people don't like things that don't look like them. The this, this is something we, we've... more organized than I had imagined based on the rumors. But it still sounds like they'll be relying heavily on us to handle both strategic and tactical engagements with the aliens. Yeah, probably. I mean, that, we are in charge. Commander, Two days. You should establish contact with the local resistance network as what? soon as possible. What do you think I'm trying the to do here? Are undoubtedly moving forward with their plans. You're the ones interrupting me. Like, see, you see this? You see how everything's just getting interrupted? Right, we want to make the proving ground, right? But the problem we've got with that is we don't have any power, so we're going to have to make this power. Oh, first. Construction initiated. Currently, there uh, there is currently an unstaffed engineer who would like to assist in building the power relay. Would you like to assign them there? Yes. Yes, I would. Well done, Lucas. You are definitely our top top engineer at the moment. He is just totally on it. Look, this guy is also going to be done. Look, we're literally going to get in there. Look, watch. We get in and we click this. Look, we didn't even get to click. I didn't even get to click. I don't know what we're going to do with this one, though, because we can't really do anything with it until we've got stuff. Okay, so we're just going to have to wait, aren't we? Can we assign another person here? We cannot assign another person here. That's a shame. Oh, I just pressed the wrong button. Uh, so hopefully over here... We can finish this now? Like, nothing else is going to interrupt us. 
Boom! Job done. Took a while. The uh, snowy wastes of New Mexico? Is that what we're seeing here? There must be sand. Must be sand. Poor, poorly rendered sand, but it is sand nonetheless. Is that number two? Is number two making contact? Yeah, that's the man. Or is that supposed to be me? I, I don't know. New objective added. The mysterious Advent Black site must be investigated by XCOM Strike Team, and any revealed artifacts must be recovered for study. Okay, let's let's do that. I mean, do, can we do a tell me more? Access. Oh, this is the stuff we want to do here. Okay, so all right, let's just go back and get on with it. Commander, we've established contact with the local resistance, and we can move on the Advent Black site on your order. We should make sure our troops are fully equipped and ready for a tough mission. I'm guessing security will be tight at the facility. Commander, I've updated our current objectives based on the most recent findings. Wow, so they've just actually named this one as a tough Reasonable mission. Contacts located. Uh, word of resistance is spreading, Commander. We're making contact with the people of New Mexico. Local resistance uh, in Brazil is ready for contact. Okay, that's cool. We set up a supply drop. A wait and pick up. We could use the additional supplies to purchase weapon armor and stuff like that. Okay, so maybe we should do that first, and then we'll do the black site, right? So that's uh, three days remaining. We gotta get Avenger over there. Plotting new course. Wop, 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 wop. That, that's how this plane moves, right? Like the, these make little wop, 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 wop noises. It's got to be the way, right? It's got to be the way. I have made a number of interesting discoveries, Commander. It's very good of you. Well done. Um, what, what have you discovered? Analysis. I have yet to discover what, if any, advantage the Advent Hybrid Soldier's enormous eyes provide. Testing their visual acuity will no doubt prove difficult. Really? You don't think? Well, we get access to the battle scanner now. That's pretty good. The battle scanner provides extra vision on the battlefield. Uh, soldiers deploy it like a grenade, throw it into the hidden area of the map they want to reveal. Which I actually really think is quite a nice thing. Uh, okay, so uh, faceless autopsy would also be good. For words to describe the difficulties we have had in attempting to handle this creature, affectionately known as the faceless, to our troops. The nebulous form of its physical structure, including a pliable, semi-solid outer layer, seems to be slowly degrading now that the creature has expired. There's it's just also a pungent odor that only seems to grow stronger as time passes. Pungent? Okay, so that was pretty good. We're going to come out of here back to the bridge. There's a lot of back and forth thing from bridge to, to uh, research at the moment, but that is the early game for you, right? That's that's all we do. Uh, so we've got through three days of this. Let's see if we can't finish this. Two, uh, no, well, no. We have acquired new targets for our guerrilla operatives against Advent. Let's let's have a look. Commander, we need to get this done. With the number right? of contacts we've established, we're getting requests for support from multiple sites around the world. Unfortunately, we only have the resources to respond to one of them. The decision is yours. Well, I'm having a look here. We're looking at counters the dark event, so that that's pretty good. Uh, destroy the alien re uh, relay, or hack the workstation in the advent facility. Now, these are relatively difficult. What have we got here? We got a scientist, or we've got some supplies. Now, we are currently mining supplies, but I think we could probably do some more. Setting course for the Western U.S. precinct. Western U.S.A. Let's have a look, shall we? Let's see what we got. Okay, so we've just got a bunch of, well, rookies going out. Oh, we got we got our man Clemson. Uh, we got Penglaze on the go here. He's not called Lightning. Uh, I, I would like to edit this, thank you. Uh, veteran cop customization options available. Commander, additional customization for yeah. Well, we don't need to read that. We, we know what we're doing. I want to customize. I want to get into the character info. I want to change his nickname because double S double T. It's only one R. That's that's the thing. I can never remember exactly how he spells his name right, but I think it's that one. Let's confirm that. I'm sure that he will get hold of me soon and be like, no, it's not how I spell my name. But we will find out. We will find out. Okay. Um, Maybe we want to give him a little bit of extra colour on his armour and stuff. Because I've just noticed that we're, we're, we're a bit low on colour in our team here. So I'm going to go with this and um, let's check the bottom line. Because these are where the best colours lie. Uh, I do like the, the red combo, but maybe a red and purple. Uh, to be fair, a lot of my guys have a red and purple combo. Um, those are some striking colours compared to what we've already got. Let's come up here and 
These are just our secondary colours, though. That's pretty poor. That's pretty poor. Let's go that. We're going to give him a, a Christmas outfit. That, that's the way it works. Brilliant. Forrest the Christmas Soldier. Ooh, uh, who have we got here? we got Rookie Thompson. That's our man, Guy. Uh, now, we've got some weapon upgrades available. We want to make sure that we, we can do some stuff to him. Increase crit chance. Now, ideally, I want to give that to one of my snipers. So I think we're going to wait. Um, weapon colour. Just want to throw in a bit of colour so we can tell what everyone's doing. And we're going to go for a zebra pattern. I think I think that's pretty good there. All right, uh, let us move on. Who knows what we're going to face today? We've got to go and try and sort out some advent troops. They are hassling our friends, and we don't, don't like it when our friends are getting hassled. You know. Sky Ranger deployed in position to drop. In position. Well then. Oh no Sky no. Ranger recall confirmed. No, it's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> Confirm. Did time pass? Have things changed? I don't know. I got all pumped and then I hit the button too early. It's terrible. It's terrible. Okay, let's see what's going on here. <laughs> we'll go through that flight, that scene again. Because everyone, everyone likes watching that twice, right? Let's just get in there and be like, Wah! Okay, number two, let's do this. No enemy standing. Glad everyone's so well camouflaged. Uh, uh, could you imagine if we like stuck out in bright blues or something? Okay, we need to get over there. Communications relay is up ahead. Move in and destroy the target. We are concealed, like ghosts. We move through the city. Now, where do you reckon is the best place to go through here? I reckon up and on buildings. Oh, what's, what was that? Look, look at this. What's this about? Is this to look through or something like that? Is that what we're being told here? I'd like to get some guys into cover. Okay, here's a good place for cover. Um, all right. Heading to that location. Let's get up there and let's see what we can spot. Hopefully, we're not going to spot too much. Hopefully, we're going to keep nice and hidden. Uh, all right, Mr. Thompson, where are you going to go? Well, I think you're going to hide behind this car for now. Fear of cars is strong in me. The fear of cars is strong. Um, unfortunately, you know, we've got to try and just deal with what we see. Right. Uh, Forrest, you are actually going to be my forward man. Let's run you up to about here. The specialists seem to do quite well as being a forward man. I'm not sure if that's what we're supposed to do with them. Maybe we're supposed to just, like, Our hang back. Our can attempt to access the Advent network from here. We might be able to hack their systems and get an advantage. But be careful. If they detect us, things will only get worse. Ah, well, that... Definitely sounds like something we should be doing then. Uh, right, Mr. Clemson, you can come over there and hide in that space there. We provide a nice little half circle of cover. I like that. We're going to just go around and get everyone on Overwatch. Might not be the best thing to do while we're uh, still concealed. Because these guys could shoot from any distance. And then we're like, our trap is sprung well early. Uh, okay. Ms. Unwin, I think you want to go here. What a good idea. What a good idea. Right, who who's next? Um, let's try Guy Thompson. He's going to come back this way. Okay. If we can just get up this way, this would be great. This would be great. Who else do we have? Mr. Forrest, my friend. How are you doing? Why can you not go up here? What's, what's the deal with that? Like, actually, what's the deal with that? Why can't, why can't I go? Ah, it's because she's there. Ah. Ah, okay, well that's something to pay attention to in the future. Alright, well we're going to have to go in and through here. Uh, I appear to be spotted wherever I go though, so that's not great. Are we going to literally have to... Hmm, maybe move down this way? Is this a thing we can do? This is a thing we can do. It's not really without any peril though. Let's just Heading out. hide there. We'll go and get everyone on the side of this place. I mean... Let's try a hack. Let's try a hack. What do we, what do we see? Uh, we can hack it. Attempt to remotely breach security in the network. Well, they, they wanted us to do this, right? They wanted us to do this. I'll Let's try. Damn straight, you're going to take a look. Go on over, little gremlin. I wonder if there's a, a precursor model called the Mogwai. Uh, that would be nice. Uh, so we can integrate comms. Uh, 66 or 29 squad gain squad site soldier gain squad site uh, well obviously we're gonna go with that one right uh, begin hack 
Because that 29% not great, right? Oh, what? Barely moved. Well, here we go. Things are getting intense. That gremlin, hey? They've spotted us. All right, well. Here we go, then. We'll do what we can. Can I fire my weapon down on him? Ah. Should, should have done it straight away. Should have done it straight away. Advent deployed non-lethal stun units for crowd control and the occasional protest. We don't see a whole lot of that anymore. Nah, like who wants to protest against people that you stun batons and stuff? Oh, that can't do that. Okay, how about there's going to be someone else a bit closer somewhere? There we go. Can you throw? Okay. Can we get up here and throw stuff down? Just try it. Moving to designated coordinates. Yes, indeed you are. We're going to throw that frag grenade. Oh, I just can't quite get where we want to be, can we? That's unfortunate. Maybe if we get yeah, there, we can like blow that up and then people can shoot at them. I think that's what we're going to... Oh, I pressed the wrong button. I right clicked instead of full clicked. Uh, so, like, yeah, like that. And now hopefully we should have all sorts of nice free shots at these guys. Hopefully, maybe, if things go well. Like, everybody should be alerted to what we're doing. Guy has moved already. Can he not do anything? No, he can't see anyone. I guess. Moving to Overwatch. Uh, now, you want to... Well, we want to do stuff with you, but you're you're there. So let's see what we can do. 46% is not the best. But hopefully we can do something. No? Okay, well, there we go. That That is our turn for today, or at least this turn uh, and we're going to see what happens here I'm not I'm not holding out all hope but we got some the, what, what are you shooting through oh well we got some, we got some damage done that that was the important oh, bit there Mr. Thompson earned a promotion and, and I agree he's definitely earned that one uh, not too keen on that though that that wasn't great that, that, in fact, if I was going to uh, sum that up with a word, I would say that was horrible. Pretty bad, actually. Okay, so Guy is going to come screaming up here and earn himself another promotion, maybe. If we can just uh, fire on this guy. 84% is pretty good, right? I said 84 is pretty good, right? I mean, what is that? What is that? Let's try and shoot this guy. 79% over the top. I mean, it's still not great. Let's come back out. Let's try and find Mr. Clemson. He, oh, God, he's not got much he can do, is there? Not much he can do. Let's try shooting from here. 68%. It's better than some of the others we're looking at. One point. One point? Uh, okay, well, I mean, that means it was a miss. Uh, but maybe Forrest can now, with his 79% hit chance, finish the job. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, well, it wasn't a finishing shot, but it was definitely a shot. One point short. Hopefully he's going to run away. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Ooh. Ah. You missed. You missed, and you ran into the guy with a shotgun. That is a little bit unfortunate for you. Yeah, whatever you say, mate. Whatever you say. Why is that blowing up? What happened there to give that the, the heebie-jeebies? I don't know. I don't know. All right, over here. You, can you slash? Yeah, slash him. Do it. Hoi-up! <laughs> you just got too close, mate. There, there was no need to have you there. Alright, everything should destroyed. be quiet again. Alright, what can we do about getting mad? Is this, is this a thing? Gremlin Hill. Can we do that? There's the Gremlin Hill. You gonna heal my friend? Heal him up! Let's see what happens. <laughs> Is that, is that a thing? Well, we're back up to full health. She is still down, though. Not ideal. Not ideal. Okay, we're going to move forwards to there. There's fire there. Maybe not to there, then. Uh, on this side? Yeah, it's full cover. Let's go down. We don't have long left, unfortunately. We, that took a long time to get that done. Oh, and now here are some more. I mean, all honestly, I'm just happy that, you know... Oh, we can go up there. No, we can carry a unit off a of battle. Uh, we're going to leave her there until she wakes up, I think. Uh, getting up there is, like, super 
awkward, so maybe if we come over this way and take a shot. Any shots to be taken? We got a 26 and a 25. Oh wow, okay. Uh, maybe a grenade? A grenade? Oh, no. No, no. Alright, maybe not then. Um, so I'm gonna have to overwatch him, maybe. Oh, is that everybody? Well, here goes then. I'm gonna see what happens. I'm expecting a grenade to come in here. Uh, oh, what have we got here? Got a mind control, maybe? Was that a failure? I hope that was a failure. What did it do? It re Oh, man. He's, like, right there. That's no good. <laughs> that's that's so not good. Got an overwatch, though. That's uh, going to be pretty poor, cool, I think. Yeah. Did we, did we blow car up or anything? That is not good. No, there's a lot of not good... Oh, wow. Ow. There's a lot of not good things going on here. Really need to try and take out that. Ooh, what was that? Thankfully, that didn't kill Jay. Wow. Okay, guy. You can get around here. Okay. And hopefully, take out that guy. Uh, firing a weapon. These are both terrible. Let's have a look at what we can do with this. Just like that. Brilliant. This is for you. Little present coming all the way from over here. That was all right. It wasn't wasn't best though, was it? Uh, Forest, can you? Oh no, you cannot. To here? What shot do we have? That's a hundred percent. That's an eighty-five percent. Now, that's pretty good. It has messed us up in the past though. Can we? I'd like to move closer, but that... oh, excuse me. It's going to put us in some funny, funny cover. So I think we're going to go this way. But let's just do it. Let's just see what we can do. Hopefully things will go well, and hopefully that will then drop him. Yeah! That's what we're talking about. Now he should fall over, right? Yep. That's what we like. That is what we like. Okay, Mr. Clemson, you actually uh, have to kind of be a saviour here. You can come running in. Understood. Move it out. But can you fire on him for a 40? Kind of going to have to do, I suppose. Oh, we are! Do not stand in the way of my people. Good riddance. Indeed. Now, we've got to try and get our way over to that, that place over there. As quick as possible. There's more alien activities. I could do without the them. The alien transmission is still active and we're running out of time. Yeah, I know, get number two. I'm trying. ASAP. Unfortunately, I'm kind of down a person. Like, the first thing that happened was one of my guys got taken out. Go, go, and how go. rubbish is that? Uh, this first dash Objective might be a here. bit strong. There we go. Got some advent here. Hmm, not ideal. Especially as we need to be able to shoot someone. All right, Forest, you really need to do something about doing something. Uh, not sure what you can do. What what that something would be? Let's come over here. No problem, boss. Now, hopefully, we should be able to fire down on that sectoid. Eighty-five percent is pretty good, right? Or just miss again. I just don't get it. Those 85s. Those 85s. Okay, we've got Dan here. He needs to come up forwards, but how to do so and still be effective. Um, here. Guy is probably going to catch a little bit of flack that we didn't want him to catch here. Uh, we're going to have to fire a weapon. 53 is terrible. Terrible. Oh! Or... <laughs> it's just the number we need. Okay, now we just need to watch and see what that guy's going to do. Here's some alien activity. His activity is to run forwards and flank my guy. Though he does seem to have just pulled himself completely out. Oh no. Oh no, what? Uh, yeah, him. <laughs> Point at him. He's <laughs> here. Yeah. Okay, what can we do to sort that out? Okay, I think guy is probably going to come over here to cover. Rolling. And if he can, I would like to shoot back at this guy. And, and we're going to wish that this takes him out. Going to see if the power of will... No. <laughs> no, no, it doesn't. Not good. Totally not good. Guns dry. Okay, this is Forrest. He is the man that needs to come up this way. Uh, he needs to get in here as quick as possible. And I don't know how we're going to do it, really. Uh, that's... At the same time, I'd really like to be able to carry on, like, 
pumping out some damage at him whilst we do so. Uh, that's a terrible shot. Uh, does this guy have a grenade left? He doesn't. Okay, well, what we're going to have to do is run up here and reload, and then we can come Save in there. I mean, that data transfer is, is unbelievable. Um, reload. Ready to go! Okay, we are ready to go, but what are we going to do with you? Uh, I don't know. Let's spin this round here so we can see kind of this line of sight. Moving. Last shot. 28% hit chance. I mean, what could go wrong? I, I just don't get it. How do these things happen all the time? Target neutralized. <laughs> I'm alright. More hostiles inbound. Don't tell me there's more stuff inbound. What? I don't want that. Are they coming in right now? This very second? This is not what we want. Well, this is going to get interesting. We got ourselves a dude. Uh, a, yeah, here, look. I mean, look at this. Like, right by my people. What am I supposed to do? The transmission signal is fading. They've almost completed the transfer. This is your last chance to take out that relay. Yeah, I know, but, like, people. <laughs> I know, but people. Uh, if we come over here... Whatever you say. Yeah, mate, you know. Then hopefully we get a shot at this. Uh, we're going to fire a weapon. This should do it, right? Four hits. I mean, I don't. I just don't know how many we need to do. Let's, let's go over and have a look. Can we, can we see? Two more. Two more. But just everywhere I go is going to be trouble, right? Trouble. Um... I mean, literally, I need to reload. Understood. Moving out. It's like the worst. It's the worst. Get to match. Got loads of people I can flank. Can't do Where anything about it. All right, Mr. Clemson, you need to come up here. Oh, and you need to reload as well. Well, this is the end of our go. Ready to go. Man, those countdowns are so tough. So tough. Is he marked? He is marked. Okay. Well, what are we gonna do about these things? I don't. I just don't know. Yeah, you know, I thought my problem was that I was just being a little bit too gung ho about it all, but it turns out I wasn't going far enough. I just. Uh, yeah. I don't know. Any any tips on on tactics here would be greatly received. Greatly received. Wow. I kind of went through my guy. We just run up and take some serious shots. Ah oh, well. Commander, it's too late. The aliens have completed the transmission and closed the connection. We missed our chance. We failed to stop the aliens' transmission, Commander. But we can still secure the AO to prevent further action here. Menace One Five, proceed to sweep the area, eliminate all hostile contacts. Well, I really thought we had like started sweeping the area. Unfortunately, these kind these people just kind of turned up and made everything very very awkward. Um, but, you know, that's, that's the way of things. That is the way of things. This, this is my guys coming out with cold rage. You know, I'm going to kill everybody now. Cannot believe the troubles we've been through. No problem, boss. Cannot believe them. Uh, we're just going to fire around the corner at this guy. Uh, that is 60%, 59%. I'd, li I'd like him to go, please. Like, in his face. Where are you pointing that weapon? Adjusting aim. <laughs> yeah, no, no. no. Uh, let's come round here, and then we can shoot that guy. Right? Oh, was that a dash move? Oh, I cannot. But so, why is it so hard for me to spot that blue line now? I'm not entirely sure. I'm not entirely Incoming, sure. Over here. Oh, we're definitely going to try and push through this. I mean, there are a lot of people out there that would take this opportunity to stop the levels and, and, and have another go at it. I don't think that's what we're going to do. I think we're just going to carry on pushing on. We're going to live with this however we can. I mean, we started this with a lose condition. That That's where we were, right? At the end of XCOM 1, every, everyone had died and everything had gone wrong. So, let's carry on just from this. 
run here. Affirmative. Moving out. And we can shoot at him. Okay, I was hoping that would be 100 Okay, he was the one to take care of first. Okay, we then need to use our other guys. If we can get to our other guys, like Forrest here, he needs to come around here and shoot that way. It's very doable, isn't it? You just move in, raise your gun, shoot him for 100 seconds. Now I just need to get my other guy in to come and do the same. Uh, my other guy, of course, being Guy. And, I don't know, do we want to kind of just... Uh, these are all dashes, right? So, kind of there then, I suppose. I don't know, it was still behind cover, so it might not have been the best plan. Probably would have been better just to go straight out and shoot from the front. You see what I'm saying? Like, this guy just cannot shoot for some reason. And one of us is going to die now because he's right there. I wonder who, like, this guy's going to die? Or is he just going to mark us up? I mean, that would be funny. All he does is do a support action. I mean, no, he's run. He's, oh, there. Critical hits. Critical hits. Poor Dan. Oh, no, that was Guy. Ooh. Why is he panicking? He's all the way over there. Well, once again, the only soldier worth any money at all is Forrest. Uh, we're just going to bring him around here. We're going to use our last little bit of ammo to pop this guy in the back of the head. Like that. Why do I only have one competent team member? And it's not my commander. I'll tell you that. I'll tell you that for free. Status confirmed. All hostiles are down and the area is secure. All right, let's bring them home. The Jeez. Is Jeez, look at that. This, this is by far... I mean, if you needed any confirmation that this is my blind playthrough, you are seeing it here. Wow. Well, it's a good job this isn't a tutorial series, eh? I mean, I <laughs> couldn't really claim to know what I was doing at this present moment in time. But, you know, I don't think we're doing too bad. We only lost one person there. And it's always a rookie. No one cares about the rookies, right? I don't. I know I don't. We've got another gravely wounded, but we're going to go through all the promotions here. ba -boom! We have got a specialist. Oh, really? This was not what I was expecting. I uh, kind of hoping for Ranger or something. Oh, well, there we go. We've got the, the hacking skills. They are strong. Um, here we go. Here's our Ranger. Out comes Mr. Clemson. He's got the slash already. Do we want the Blade Master plus two damage on all sword attacks? Or Phantom, when the squad is revealed, this soldier remains concealed. Ooh. Ooh. I think I'm going to go with Phantom. I probably should have done the... the, the extra damage probably would have done done me better overall but there we go we didn't manage to collect anything because we just basically really had a bad run uh and we're gonna see what goes on here the advent stun lancer is commonly seen maintaining order and quelling disturbances throughout the world their unique stun lance can be adapted into a weapon our rangers are already training to use hello commander thank uh, hi um how's it going yeah, you, you, I mean, blatantly, this is his fault. He's just sending me off on missions that my team are not ready for. <laughs> We're getting thin on manpower, Commander. We should check with Resistance HQ for new recruits. Okay, let's go and find how we do that. Uh, we've got a shaken soldier. That's all right. Uh, Dan Clemson has recovered, though. That's good. That's good. Okay, let's have a look in here. I think we need to uh, recruit. Let's have a look at our soldiers first. We've been first. picking up some weird transmissions lately. It sounds a little like German, but it's hard to tell. Right, so we need at least one more so sh shoulder, one more soldier, because we've only got three available, and that—that's why they're complaining. Okay, so let's come back and recruit. Uh, I think we're going to recruit. Uh, oh, I don't know who should we recruit here. Uh, it doesn't really matter because I am going to go through and change them. So one, two, job done. Oh, and with that, I am going to say thank you very much for joining me for today's defeat. I will see you next time where hopefully the defeat won't happen, but we... Oh, who knows? Who knows what's going to happen? But I will see you then when we're going to find out. Bye!